Hello, so before the video starts, I'm just here to remind you that if you enjoy this video, make sure you subscribe, that way you won't miss any of my videos in the future. Also, I'm doing a giveaway right now over at my Discord server, link for that is in my description. Rust is a game of numbers. And the group with the most numbers will always win. And this is what makes playing solo so hard. It doesn't matter how good you are, you still only have 100 HP. And well, when that reaches zero, you lose. But of course our story starts off on the beaches of rust all right let's go I put down a base in the middle of the map, hoping that they would bring a lot of action. <sighs> I went out to hit some barrels. Get the fucking shit out of me. I found a decayed base while running around the area. Okay. 
I wanted to destroy the TC so I could pick up everything in the base. Destroyed the TC and picked up a few things from the base. Okay. Let's get this home. This is big. Level 2 workbench and 2 guns. It's huge. I started hearing a raid in the distance. This is also a new segment I like to call IUK Malts While Dying. Check this out. No! These guys are so slow at raiding, holy fuck, just leave this place already. <gasps> Why is he still there? Why are they still there? They've been there for 30 minutes now. Holy fuck, they're bad at the game. Why? You're so annoying. You're so annoying. Are we playing another base? Okay, so uh, they're just going on a fucking raiding spree, raiding every single base in this area. Where do they, do they even live? That's what I want to know. Buckshots! <laughs> Buckshots, how are you not dead? Buckshots fucking suck bro. 10 HP, fuck you. They're still here. Why? I don't understand why they're still here. They're so slow. It's actually crazy. I see. They're fucking everywhere. Oh, 
why. Why? That's so annoying. After two hours of this group refusing to leave my area, there were finally some peace. my area is gonna be a little bit more quiet now i might be able to get up a main base and stuff like that i can research the star i got have a gun there i already have a tier 2 so i decided to spend the next hour farming It was time to put down a main base. The design of the base will be linked in the description. What? No! Die! Okay, so people don't die. Got it. Are they nerfed slugs or what the fuck is going on?
We moved all of the loot over from the starter base to the main base. A new base popped up overnight. I knew it would be in my best interest to get rid of these guys as fast as possible. Otherwise I knew these guys would become a problem. How? Didn't both die? Oh. They had made a big mistake when building their base. They had left the triangle above their door twig. Oh wait. So I quickly geared up and ran back. Okay, that's super good. I needed to get rid of those neighbors. It would have become a big problem in the future, I just know it. This was a big come up. Not only had I eliminated a threat in my area, but I also made it out with a lot of loot. After this I did some more upgrades to the base. And then I logged off. The next day started with me farming some components. I then went over to bandit camp and recycled.
Finally, we got something else than a semi. I don't like to craft semis, they cost too much. I researched the Thompson and then ran towards an airdrop in the distance. What the fuck? Oh my god, there's so fucking many of them, bro. Everyone's just so many. Okay, I need a break. I had just lost my first tier 3 gun. And, as you would expect, I wasn't too happy about it. So, I took a break. And when I came back, I started hearing shots in the distance. So I ran over naked to investigate. getting pissed <laughs> I'm getting pissed <laughs> oh. need to get some end game guns can't fucking 1v14 with a fucking semi or custom or whatever need some real guns And after so much struggling, here is where this wipe took a turn for the better. I bought a boat at the fishing village and then I made my way over to large oil rig.
This was a huge come up. Okay, that was super good. Two AKs and an LR. Explosive ammo and a bunch of shit. This is so good. I depoted everything in base and then I went straight back to oil rig to do it one last time. Almost lagged. <laughs> Got killed there. This shit I'm out. I went over to bandit camp where I recycled. I used the scrap to research some important items. I need a garage door. I don't want to sell a garage door. And the wood tea to stock up on wood. Then I heard some AKs in the distance. Why? So I can't see them. It's so unfair.
I can't use an AK without a holo sight for some reason. I just can't. Can't use it. I'm fucking trash with AK without holo. I finished up most of the base. And then I went to Rome for a bit. How low are you? I started hearing a raid close by. They managed to secure the base before I could do anything. So I waited outside. But they were smart and ran out naked to see if anyone was camping outside. mad that he shaked that bush <sighs> come out and fight I'm not waiting by the door I want them to come out and fight me you're raiding a two by two it's not fucking rocket science just go out you have the loot Go back to your base, that's what you're supposed to do. You raid a base, and then you go. You stupid fuck. So dumb! Please die! Please kill him! Please kill him! Whoever lives there! Please kill him! Please kill him! Please kill him! Yes! 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 You're so stupid! People don't think. They see a guy and they're like, oh, monkey brain shoot living thing. Dumb fucking bitch. Sounded like they were finally leaving the base. So I ran back to see what I could do. Right, they did not just deserve that loot. Not one bit, they deserve that loot. Like the way they were playing, they just didn't, they just didn't deserve it. his friend <laughs>
I had to get a win against those guys. Holy fuck, I deserved that. They still like they still didn't go out with the loot from the base, which is <laughs> hilarious. But they still like it has to be it has to be so good loot up there because they had so many chances to go out and they, they went out. They just didn't go out with the loot or didn't run away. Like they've had so many chances where they could have run away. But because they're so scared, they just lost it all because we're too scared. A shiny crate had dropped at power plant, so I went to check it out. Run so it doesn't matter if I die. Live. Go for the crank. There's mud on the floor. Desperate people trying to get through the door, although the room's already crowded. But I'll keep shining. Although you are with your wings entwining. You better face the fall, keep trying. I'm gonna go home and depot because this is a lot of guns that I desperately need.
forgot to bring out ammo. And I killed him with my last bullet. I'm so lucky. Oh my god. Yes, moonshine. Can actually see. Now, after this, the wipe took a turn for the worse. <laughs> That's of course. I make the clutch just play ever and I die to a fucking... 
kid just sneaking up. And there's multiple too. Fuck off. Now, don't get me wrong, I had a few wins too. But I needed something big. So I crafted some explosive ammo and went out to the snow to look for a base to raid. After a bit of searching, I found this one. This could be worth it. Yeah. Let's go for this one. Gotta be kidding me. The raid had been a big fail. And in all honestly, I was getting tired of the server. So I went on one last roll. There's too many. <laughs> oh. And I don't really think there's a better way to end this video than with just this. It looks like I've made an absolutely insane play. Just to be reminded that numbers always win. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hey, just so you know, I have a Twitter account where I post memes, video teasers and much more. So make sure you go and follow me over there. 
If you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe and leave a like on it. Also, leave any feedback on how I can improve my videos down in the comment section. If you want to support me a little extra, you can do that over at my Patreon. All the links for that is in my description. But I will see you guys in the next video. Peace and goodbye.